choose to go to the moon in this decade and do the other things, not because they are easy, but because they are hard. Johnny, with all this talk about aliens and UFOs, and if they do prove to be bloody true, doesn't that mean we've got to rethink our military bloody strategy? And uh, we don't want to get caught with our pants down by aliens, so to speak. UFOs, Johnny, well, if they do turn out to be true, Johnny, we are going to have to change our strategy, so to speak. So to speak. Strategy, so to speak. Because we don't, as you say, want to get caught with our fucking pants down, so to speak. <laughs> So, Johnny, do you really think that there could be bloody aggressive aliens out there? But it's funny you should mention it now, Johnny, because there's just been an ad, an advert, a recruiting advert. The RAF, the RAF have released to, to recruit people and it's a bit fucking, uh, well, you have a look at it. Okay, I'm seeing a potential collision with new space debris. Oh, bring it on. What Jesus, the chefs are on high alert too. Oh, that soup looks pretty good. Will you just let the ad run, you stupid prick? We don't need your comment. Carrying out collision avoidance maneuver. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. Satellite collision avoidance. It takes the whole force to protect space. Join us. Well, what a bloody advert, Johnny, but can those jets get it? Can those jets they're showing get into outer space? I don't know whether... Johnny, that seems to me like they're absolutely targeting uh, people for uh, a space war of some sort. Well, if there are bloody... If it's proved that there are aliens there, well, then, then, then we've got to bloody... We've got to be suspicious that... We've got to be suspicious that some of the bastards may be aggressive. <laughs> The point was, the RAF are now saying, this is their claim, that they are there to protect space. Space! The final frontier. So it all sounds a bit mysterious, Johnny. A bit mysterious. Why in 2023, we've got all this hubbub of uh, 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 maybe aliens, maybe not. And it's just the time that, uh, that some countries are wanting to bloody uh, militarise space, so to speak. So to speak. It just seems a bit bloody... Uh, a bit. We're protecting space around the Earth because there might be, there could be, there probably will be an alien invasion. Yeah, well, there is talk, Johnny, that it, it, all this could be a whole fucking big psyop, as they call it, a big hoax perpetrated by the bloody governments of the world to get us all bloody shit scared. But, Johnny, couldn't this mean that, uh, similar to what uh, the world was shit scared about three years ago, get everybody shit scared so we can just uh, we can just do whatever we want and we'll get all the money for this and all the money for that and space bloody, space force and Christ knows what, when in actual fact there's, uh, there, there's no one out there? People out there saying, if they reckon there's going to be an alien invasion, don't believe it. Because it's bullshit. And I tend to bloody be a bit suspicious about it too. Do you think there's any truth to that? Well, if you were intent to destroy us, I think they would have done it by now. They wouldn't be waiting for us to have nuclear technology, super fast jets and all that, which probably are useless against them anyway. But why would you wait till now when... I don't know, it just seems like it's just one more of... Yes, yes, that's true. Oh, maybe, maybe this is just part of the narrative. Maybe there are that group of people who want to take over the world and have one world government. They're not aliens, they're just psychopaths. But let me tell you, Johnny, the Ask Johnny channel, if they are, if we are invaded, we're going to fight tooth and nail to, for our fucking freedoms, for our human freedoms. We're not going to let any fucking uh, lily-livered bloody little green men take over the joint.